Hi, I'm Lisa Dodson, USPTA Professional One and inventor of the Total Serve. Today I'd like to share with you three secrets to a better serve. If you can start mastering these principles today, you'll start having the stress-free, dominant, and powerful serve that you've always wanted. Our first secret is to relax. Now you hear it all the time, but nobody really knows what it means. So I'm going to give you a quick exercise that's going to let you feel what that actually means. So in order to relax, what we're going to do is we're going to put our hand on the grip with our continental grip or whatever we're calling our grip. And what you're going to do is slide your hand down so that you only have one thing, finger and your thumb on the racket. And the rest of your fingers are balled up underneath the racket. So I have a really wobbly grip on here. This will let go of the racket head. It will absolutely loosen up your arm because you have no control over the racket head. So we want this nice and whippy and loose so we can use all the links in the arm. This is what it's supposed to feel like when you serve. It's not supposed to feel like a muscular action. So go from one finger in the thumb to two fingers on your thumb to three and then gently put your full hand on there with the correct grip and see if you can keep this nice fluid whippy motion going. You'll notice a huge difference in your serve immediately. Our second secret is to look up before you toss. Clear vision is essential to a good contact point. So if your head's moving around and your eyes are moving around, you're not going to see the ball clearly. You're going to see all good servers after they're prepared and they get ready to start their serve, you're going to see them look up and then start their service action. So they're basically looking up into a spot, a picture frame, whatever you want to call it up there, where they know that their, their toss is going to be going into. And in advance, we have our eyes and head set up, so we're expecting the ball to come into that spot. There's also the fact that you have to really look up and not out, because most people actually look out to a toss and not up. So from this angle, you can see when I'm looking up, my head is actually back on my shoulders. And most people are going to be looking out. Now my head is still up a little bit, it's tilted up, but I'd have to peek up with my eyeballs in order to see the ball, and that's not very efficient. Okay? So I want my head up, and you notice it also helps the angle of my shoulders for going driving up to the ball. The third secret is to hold the ball flat in your hand when you toss. The tossing hand and arm are very neglected when they're taught and people really just don't even know what they're doing with their non-dominant hand. So the simplest and the most effective way to get a toss that's going to go straight up and down and not arc and not spin is to hold it flat on your hand. So hopefully from this angle you can see that I have it right across the creases of my finger with my thumb over the top gently and my wrist is laid back. If I don't lay my wrist back, I'm going to get a ball that, that curves forward back. And that's not a good thing. We want our toss to be going out and forward. So with the wrist laid back, I can get all set and toss, pop my hand open, and I'm going to have a nice ball that travels straight up and down without any arc, without any spin. You're going to be able to see it clearly, and you're going to be relaxed when you go to hit it. Start working today on one of these secrets and pretty soon you'll be mastering your serve. Again, this is Lisa Dodson, USPTA Pro 1 and inventor of the Total Serve. Happy serving!